make sure you guys check out www.procivic.com for all your 9th gen and civic needs. And also make sure you guys check out www.blinkingbrakelights.com for blinking brake light tail bulbs, which can help you better be seen and safe out in traffic. Use the code GOT10 at checkout for 10% off. So, I actually just got done installing a Buddy Club short shifter on my car. I'm gonna take you on a quick little ride, give you my honest thoughts and opinions on it. I'm gonna be honest, the throw is not much different than stock. The throw may be a little shorter, but it's still not short enough for me, if that makes any sense. That's why I think I might switch to an Acuity short shifter still. But let's give it a whirl here. Wow, downshifting is pretty freaking nice. I must admit, it makes downshifting a lot easier. Personally, I think that this is the best investment. I mean, obviously I got the short shifter for a steel. So if you're gonna sit here and complain about the fact that I got a buddy club and not an acuity, well, guess what? The price kind of, you know, scared me away from the acuity. And I, it honestly does not justify paying 400 or $480, however much that thing costs to buy an acuity short shifter. In my humble opinion, like the way I drive the car, the Buddy Club short shifter is not short enough, um, which is exactly why I feel like the acuity short shifter is gonna solve a lot of those problems. The shifter feels the same as stock. It like, it not, in terms of the throw, it's shorter, but the, the feel of it, you know, shifting gears and getting actually into gear is the same as stock. You know? But overall, my opinions of the short shifter, out of 10, I'll give it a solid six, okay? Simply because of the fact that it's not short enough for me. Um, I think that this will do just fine in the autocross season. I wish I had like a ruler to kind of measure, you know, the exact amount that, you know, it reduces the, the throw by. You know, I'll give Buddy Club some credit. Their short shifter is an awesome bolt-on upgrade for OEM, but for me, I prefer shorter. I said that the the throw needs to be a little shorter for me. Um, like I mentioned before, for now, this will have to do um, simply because that an Acuity short shifter, that $400 price tag does not justify me going out to buy one. Um, I do plan on upgrading to an Acuity, but funds don't permit it right now. I got this Buddy Club short shifter for a freaking steal. Butter. Absolute butter. Like I said, I still I still will give it a solid 6 out of 10. Do I recommend the Buddy Club short shifter? I would say yes and no, depending on your budget. Simply depending on your budget. The short shifter itself is nice. It gives you a nice, sweet, short throw. You know, it, it honestly improves your shifting by quite a lot. Um, it improves my shifting by quite a lot. But it's not much different from OEM. It's a very slight shortness of the throw. Very slight. Um, but do I recommend the short shifter for somebody who only is in the market for $100 short shifters? Absolutely. Do I, you know, there was this um, Siri Moto short shifter upgrade. Don't do that. Just just go and buy yourself an $100, you know, $150 Buddy Club short shifter. You know, it's much better. It's an actual assembly. You don't have to hack up your OEM shifter assembly. And what's great about the, the Buddy Club is that if you decide to take it off and resell it, you actually can. Unlike, you know, with the OEM one, you're stuck with a short shifter for who, who knows how long. And if you plan to resell the car, you know, who knows, that could be a point, you know, where the, the next buyer could be turned off simply because it has a short shifter in it. The Buddy Club short shifter. It's a great bolt-on modification for anybody who is in the market for a short shifter but doesn't want to spend too much. I think that this is a great budget short shifter and it's very simple, easy to install. Um, in terms of 
you know, actual price. If you have $500 to spend on a short shifter, go for the Acuity. And I'm gonna explain why. Because the Acuity short shifter gives you the ability to adjust how short the gate throw is and how short the actual throw is, which is great. Um, because my gate throw right now with the buddy club, I would keep the, the gate throw exactly the same and then I would shorten the actual throw itself by maybe 10% because even though this short shifter is great and all, I still highly think that the Acuity is a much, much, much better short shifter. So if you're in the market and if your budget is, is about 150 to $200, the buddy club is a short shifter for you. If you are in the market for something a little bit more expensive, something more flashy and something you can actually adjust, go for the Acuity Short Shifter. And that's been my review on the Buddy Club Short Shifter. And expect, you know, an Acuity Short Shifter install video to be coming within the next few months because I really do plan to upgrade this Short Shifter um, even though this is great. In terms of the actual knob height, like the, the shift knob height, it's the same as stock. Completely the same as stock. It has not changed whatsoever in terms of the height there's no height difference whatsoever so if you're if you're actually wondering about the the shifter height there's no difference it's oem um with the acuity short shifter you can adjust the height of the the knob itself as well so a, a solid six out of ten buyer boy on the buddy club short shifter hopefully you guys enjoy this little rushed but small review video on the Buddy Club Short Shifter. This has been your boy God of Maliga. You can you can follow me on Instagram and on Twitter. That's down in the description below. I'm out. Peace.